בסך הכל מתנהג בסיס של מערבית I don't have a reaction because I haven't seen the details of the deal, the reports, the preliminary reports that I've heard uh, that Saddam has accepted uh, free and unfettered uh, uh, access of the uh, uh, UN monitors, uh, inspectors in Iraq. Uh, if that is true and there are no uh, complicating details, that is good news, but uh, I cannot tell you uh, that that is the case yet. Mr. Prime Minister, aren't you worried that now the whole area will reshift on the peace process Well, I don't think there's a, a double standard. I think there's an equal standard. Uh, Iraq, uh, Saddam Hussein is a ruthless dictator who uh, used poison gas against his own people and has committed every possible form of aggression. Uh, the U.S. demands compliance. Uh, in our case, we demand compliance from the Palestinians who promise to fight terror, uh, the same terror of, uh, uh, that knows no bounds, that we seek to control and they promise to control. So I think uh, in this case, if you want to seek the question of compliance, look elsewhere. Mr. Prime Minister, with the Palestinians having adopted the right attitude, what they perceive as having adopted the right attitude in this crisis, uh, why do you keep saying that we live in an old new Middle East or a new old Middle East? What, what right attitude are you talking about? Well, a few weeks ago, they organized, they actually organized the demonstrations in favor of Saddam Hussein. In these demonstrations, they called for Saddam to bomb Tel Aviv and to destroy Israel. These demonstrations were organized only a few weeks ago by the Palestinian Authority. I'm glad they realized what a public uh, relations disaster this is for them in Israel, in the United States, and elsewhere. I'm glad they chose to uh, take it back, but I would have been more glad, a lot more glad, if they decided to do that, not out of expediency, not because of the damage it does to them in public relations, but because of the damage it does to peace. And what we expect of the Palestinian Authority is to educate their people truly, deeply, profoundly for peace, and not as a tactical uh, uh, movement away from uh, uh, the censures that they would receive in Western public opinion. Ken Davis. Mr. Prime Minister, are you not concerned this morning, sir, that Saddam Hussein, with his proven track record, is really putting one over on Kobe Annan? Secondly, in light of today's developments, will you be ordering some kind of stand down in Israel's readiness? I think it's too early to say what the results of this uh, agreement are. We'll wait to see. Uh, to assess both what is happening in the Gulf and what uh, should happen here. But I have to say that in general, the level of preparedness that has been achieved uh, is something that we would like to maintain. Uh, exactly how, with what kind of means, uh, is something that we, uh, uh, we will judge. But I think we've uh, learned a great deal and uh, actually gained quite a bit of experience, valuable experience, uh, in all the civil defense systems that have uh, worked together uh, to prepare our civil defenses.